Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this is part four of building this finger joint box. It's really been a lot easier than I would have thought. So, we've made the four sides, and we've made the top, and basically at the bottom too. So, you've saved a step there. So, you just take your, and I would su suggest starting with this one here, and if you have snap to object, You've got that right there done. Now I would make a duplicate of that top, control D, because you're going to maybe mess it up. So we need, and you're really maybe not, we need to take the virtual segment delete key and delete that right there. And I think that will work. Now I'm going to take my Smart Fill tool and fill that in and move it out of the way. The reason I think that will work is it, yeah, I'm pretty, I'm almost positive that will work. So now we can get this out of the way and you can see we broke it off. So hopefully you made a copy of that, which I did not. I have already erased it. So that's one thing I always suggest is to make copies. This piece is exactly the same, so we'll make a duplicate of it right now. And just for safety, we'll make another one and just put it over there. So we have this one that is the um, top is right here. And it was elongated because we were working with this, this edge. And just kind of prove that that's what we were working with. And I'm going to see if this works. I'm not 100% sure this is going to work. But we need to snap to that. And now we need to mirror that. And it worked. Because this is what we need. It, you, couldn't, it, you could have snapped to this, but this is a lot easier. I don't know if you realize what I just did. I had this item like that because it snapped. To that corner well this corner doesn't really have a stop to spot to snap snap to now there's a way around that but you could put it in the center of the paint but this one snaps to it those two nodes if you have snap to object on which is under view snap to object and then just take that and mirror it and then we'll do the same thing we'll take and delete that part and use the smart fill tool and fill it in move it out of the way and we can get rid of that piece and then I would suggest immediately getting rid of these other pieces because these are your two good pieces now we just knew do the exact same thing to the bottom Nothing fancy about it. Control D and make a duplicate. Put those out of the way. I would delete. Well, you won't have those. Those are boxes that I previously done. And I'm not going to take your time in the video to do that because it's well. Uh, I could do it real quick, but it's the exact same thing because they're exact same pieces. So take that piece and snap to it and do the exact same thing. Now just keep in mind that you need a top and a bottom, and then the four pieces. And I'm going to make one more short video. I'm going to finish this, and I'm going to go out in the shop. And first of all, I'm going to make sure it works perfectly and tell you a little bit about it and maybe how to glue it together. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit, and thank you for watching.